So uh, my optional was mathematics. In my first attempt, I scored 270 in the optional and in this attempt, I got 326 marks in the optional. So for what worked for me is, see, mathematics is a very uh, long optional. You all know that it requires much greater time as compared to other optionals. If other optionals take three to four months to complete one revision, mathematics needs six to seven months for the first revision. But believe me that at the end of the process, it's really rewarding. UPSC is a little subjective uh, process. So when you know that something is objective, when you have, for example, when I attempted my optional paper mathematics this year, I knew that I'm clearing mains. I knew I would be in the list. Yes, the rank might differ that nobody knows, but I knew that I would be in the list because I knew my maths accuracy. I knew what kind of score I can get in mathematics. So that really helps boosting my uh, boost that really boosted my confidence. So my strategy for mathematics has always been limit, uh, limited resources. I didn't follow any books just for the physics portion like statics and dynamics. For that, I followed the Krishna series. So for the other 11 topics, I followed IMS notes and I think that those notes are the most wonderful thing a mathematics optional aspirant can have. Those notes are regularly updated. The another thing that worked for mathematics optional was the test series. So not just this year test series, I solved past three years test series. So that give, gave me a large question bank, that gave me a large time to practice it and that really helped me to increase my accuracy. Since the pattern of the examination is changing, we all know that the questions have become easier, but you need to have a uh, good accuracy in those questions. So for that, you need a large practice. So for that, I think you should have a large question bank and you should solve past two to three years test series.